everyone and welcome to a new video before we move on make sure you like subscribe and hit that notification bell you can also drop a comment about what you think about the video today we've actually got a couple of things to do uh, new projector headlights are going on the beetle uh, there was an air vent missing that has to go on I've not had the wiper motors installed on this beetle funnily enough for the past 15 years so I got a new motor with the whole mechanism so that is going in and other than that there's a glove box that needs to be repaired and that needs to go in. Also I've got a retro looking mp3 player uh, that fits with the theme of the bug that I shall be putting in today so let's go and get all of these things done. So those of you who are new to the channel, this is my 1970 Volkswagen Beetle. As you can see, it is not a regular Volkswagen Beetle. It is a completely custom design, uh, one of the first chop top Beetles in the country. What it has is a Mitsubishi Pajero 660cc Japanese engine. When I needed to restore this car, I had put in a Toyota 4 AGE, but that's a discussion for some other time. Today, we are putting some new parts in the car, and let me show you. I have them right here. These are projector headlights that I got from Amazon. Uh, the existing lights do have HIDs, but they don't work very well. This is what will be going in. Other than that, bits and bobs missing in the car, even though it does have a stereo, I needed something that complemented the look of the car a little bit more. So here is a retro styled stereo that is going to go in. Other than that, some other goodies that I have lying around are Here they are. So let me pull this seat forward. So this is a, a Viper motor that I had been missing for the last 13 to 14 years. So I got a new one because I tossed out the old one. I don't know, I will be needing it in the future. Then there's this glove box that I bought. It wasn't as broken as it is now, but I hope to fix it and install this. And last but not, not least is this air vent that I had been missing. So all of these parts are going to go in and let's go to the workshop. So while my electrician at Fargo Sun is working on the Beetle, I will give you a quick tour of my other project, this 1986 Honda CRX. And yes, it needs a lot of work. I basically got it in the condition you see it in. Only the doors have been changed a little bit. Roof and floor work has been done. But more or less it was like, here's a bag of rust and here are some documents. This is a Honda CRX. Long way to go, no engine. Uh, yeah, but it needs to be sorted. Other than that, uh, over here we have got Farhad's Darsal 120Y Ute project. Uh, by the time this video is being uploaded, the bodywork has been done, the engine work has been done, and it is awaiting paint. So the lights are installed and I will say I'm pretty pleased with the result. The wiper motors and the stereo are also in and I am really happy with that result as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and the mods that went on the Beetle. Uh, I just have to figure out what wipers to put on because regular wipers won't go on here. I'll probably get 
a pair of wipers from a ruksha or something <laughs> and put those in so maybe that's another video altogether if you did like the video uh like share subscribe and make sure you drop a comment uh about what you think uh, about this belt thank you see you in the next video